time is never enough. Every one of us has only 24 hours a day. Speak for yourself. Yet much of it is wasted procrastinating. Or looking at various you clocks. that you had more control of your time? There. I would like more control of my time. Introducing the Rubato clock. Hey! The clock it doubles as an umbrella. It's the display time. It's a nice looking clock. Sure. And behavior. Without losing huh? Of Wait, why is the clock just moving on its own? Well, I don't know what time it is. I'm a bad clock. Productive mode is activated. So, the gimmick is this clock tells time incorrectly on purpose to pressure you into doing work. So instead of the clock operating on time, it operates on RNG? performance. <laughs> it's the- that's- first half of the hour is very fast, and the second half of the hour is really slow. To reality. You know, but real world time. Oh, and that makes you more productive. Yes, because here's the graph that shows you productivity with the clock faces that you use. To allow you to devote yourself to the things that really This is this is actually a clock that is purposefully broken. Traveling to a new country? But forgotten to adjust Won't you know that? Managing if you hang it up on your wall? Never been easier. You mean that your big wooden clock is totally off all the time, and you know that because you bought it, it would nullify the effect. What time is it? I mean, what is my I... clock that purposes is purposely wrong? Dynamically <laughs> altering the progression of the. Oh, here's time warp mode. <laughs> can invoke your productive or creative side. This no what? If you like to see time, in the these people are productive even though they can't see the clock. Rubato clock is <laughs> the countdown of a set duration. Think of it. As a visual time it could be any time. time, let's go! <laughs> ah! The hands move <laughs> Wait, this part is Look just... at how many paper footballs they were able to make. They're so productive. Wow. Like magic. Wow? What's wow? <laughs> For the past few months. But look, then they went it went to 410, but you don't know if it's really 410 or not now. Sustainable materials like bamboo and combing the electronics market to source out reliable. Hang on, let me see what time it is, Richardson is back there. <laughs> Oh my god, I only have half an hour Oh no, wait, 40 minutes left. This is... I mean, this part's unnecessary. I believe you can make a wooden clock. The Rubato clock. Can you at least make it do normal time? I think you can. You can, which then... Then it just becomes like, oh, it's a nice little wooden clock. Then it becomes a very pricey clock. Yes. Yes. My god. Okay, like, like I can understand having like a shitty analog clock in like your bathroom or something that's like always five or ten minutes ahead. I yeah, my wife does that with like the car kind of like sure. time, you know, she set it ahead. But like, why would you want one where the actual time doesn't move linearly and you're not quite sure how much time you have left? Because you need motivation and a contemporary design piece in your household. I mean, this is just really gonna screw you up, though. Like, if you just—if you really <laughs> absolutely needed to know the time, and you looked at this clock, it's like, wait, uh oh. Um, and what's to top, stop you from just checking the time on, say, your phone that everyone always carries around twenty-four hours a day? <laughs> yeah, I know. Like, oh, it's this is the actual time. <laughs> wait, let me get motivated. Let me look at the fake time. Okay, now I can work. This clock, by the way, um. Costs about $77, too. Oh, my. Okay. Yeah, that's... Yeah. Then, honestly, that's 35% off of retail value. That's, like, the Kickstarter kind of exclusive, you know? Of course. Right. You can get them in 8-inch or 12-inch. It's the perfect tabletop accessory. Every ta every tabletop accessory has always <laughs> advertised itself as the perfect <laughs> one. Mm -hmm. But... There's so many out there. Oh, wait. <laughs> wait, look at this crap. I can't believe a simple idea like this helped me get into the zone faster and be more productive. Wow, that was quoted by THE Kai Wei. Uh oh <laughs> Wow, Kai Wei, he's the most efficient person I've seen in this photo. <laughs> Bluetooth! Oh, really? I, I, I can't... <laughs> Wait, the fact is kind of... The fact is funny, this is great. Wait, so does it actually tell the time? <laughs> no? Uh-oh. That's more than, it's more than twice as accurate as an ordinary, no it's not, the whole thing of it is, oh my god. Uh, you can calibrate your clock with the phone app. Oh, I see. So you can just make it a, just a regular clock. Mm -hmm. Okay. And you'll see the real time as you do that. 
Um, so why I'm would I want to clock that purposely? It doesn't tell me the right time. Oh, you can just leave it on normal mode. But you know how actually we were just talking about that. But like <laughs> it's it's just a very sophisticated way of doing that to, to confuse you. All right, I I'm sold. It's about time. Uh, is it? <laughs> I don't know. Ah! Ah!